Number 7. This is 1962 Franklin Half Dollar in MS66 condition. Comes with full bell lines. According to Heritage Auctions, the Franklin Half Dollar might have gone on for many years past 1962, but the year turned out to be the penultimate one for the design as the denomination was chosen to memorialize the assassinated John F. Kennedy. This uncommonly well-struck premium gem with full bell lines has understated yet colorful patina ranging from powder blue to rose violet over vibrantly lustrous surfaces. It was sold for $2,520. Number 6. Here is phenomenal 1964 proof Kennedy half dollar with accented hair. Graded as PR68 deep cameo by PCGS. According to Stax Bowers, of the 3,950,762 proofs that the Philadelphia Mint struck for the first year 1964 Kennedy half dollar, Rick Tomaska, a guidebook of Franklin and Kennedy half dollars, 2018, estimates that only about 100,000 coins are of the accented hair variety. This brief type was terminated after Jacqueline Kennedy inspected the new half dollars bearing her husband's portrait at the request of Mint personnel. The former first lady objected to some of the finer hair details and recommended changes, which eventually resulted in the revised Type 2 design. The easiest way to differentiate between the Type I and Type 2 designs is to look at the hair strands directly above Kennedy's ear. On the accented hair variety two prominent strands in this area form a V-shape that is not seen on Type 2 examples. Additionally, the Type I variety has a weak or broken lower left serif on the letter I in Liberty, as well as slight pitting and rounded edges to the shield on the eagle's breast on the reverse. This elusive specimen ended up selling for $6,000. Number 5. This is 1966 Kennedy half dollar in MS67 plus condition. A wonderfully original, vividly toned superb gem that really needs to be seen to be fully appreciated. Intense satin luster provides additional vibrancy to many of the colors, among which are shades of reddish rose, emerald green and champagne apricot. Thoroughly appealing in a Kennedy half dollar, and sure to be of keen interest to series specialists and toning enthusiasts alike. It was sold for $9,400. Number 4. This is 1973 D. Kennedy half dollar struck over 1972 D. Washington quarter. An error coin with MS67 grade from NGC. A dramatic 75 cent double denomination error. The head and wings of the eagle from the half dollar overlap Washington's portrait. Similarly, the head and wings of the eagle from the quarter emerge near Kennedy's ear. The half-dollar mint mark is bold. The half-dollar date is partial, but the upper curl of the three is present. The quarter date is readable near 6 o'clock on the half-dollar reverse, and the quarter mint mark is apparent near the reverse rim at 4.30. It was sold for $11,750. Number 3. Here is 1950 Franklin half dollar in MS67 condition with full bell lines. According to Heritage, no mint sets were issued for the year 1950, resulting in few attractively toned half dollars in the upper reaches of mint state condition. This exquisitely toned, exceptionally lustrous half dollar is an exception. A superb gem in every sense of the words, the smooth, unmarked surfaces are vividly toned in circular bands of multicolored iridescence. Hues of lime green, ruby red, orange, blue, magenta, and tangerine gold cover both sides of the coin. The obverse displays intense tones and luster rim to rim, while the reverse is equally colorful, but with a larger center of blazing silver luster. It was sold for $12,925. Number 2. This is 1968 S. Kennedy half dollar in PR70 deep cameo condition. The 1968 S. Proof Kennedy half dollar is a great rarity in PR70 deep cameo. This piece is fully struck and brilliant with stark white on black contrast. The surfaces are perfect. It fetched a sum of $21,600 at auction. Number 1. And this is 1964 Kennedy half dollar from Special Mint Set. This SMS example was graded as SP68 by PCGS. Stunningly rich and original velvety smooth surfaces are blessed with an almost brushed nickel gray color that serves to accentuate the bold strike and strongly incised features of the design, all of which serve to make these very special coins stand out from even proof 1964 Kennedy half dollars. The reverse is ever so slightly lighter in color, but no less bold with only the barest hint of a light golden hue along the diagnostic squared off wire rim. Thoroughly impressive and enchanting in every regard and a true wonder to behold. It ended up selling for $156,000. Thanks for watching this video.
Consider subscribing to our channel for more captivating numismatic content. Have a good one.